Let's talk about the trees. What is the importance of trees in our life? Well, trees play a very important role in everyone's life as they provide oxygen as well as some uh, uh, some kind of uh, uh, other things uh, that are beneficial for us like uh, they provide uh, wood for making furniture in our houses and uh, also for uh, fruits, flowers and uh, for some remedies also. How can weather affect trees? Uh, well, weather affect uh, uh, very highly because whenever uh, it, uh, it is wind, uh, rainy weather then uh, environment get fresh and plants get watered. So if uh, the weather is uh, quite uh, harsh, so hot or uh, uh, some kind of uh, uh, very warm then the soil erosion can occur and it can loss to the uh, trees, uh, loss of water in the trees. Okay, what contribution can people do to make the environment clean and green? Uh, well, in my opinion, I like to suggest that people should de reduce the cutting down of trees so that the environment get uh, 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 green, green and uh, also uh, people should plant more and more trees in their uh, uh, in a space where they uh, they can as uh, I, ho I also plant trees on my birthday whenever uh, in my uh, small private garden uh -huh. I uh, plant trees in every bird. Does place or soil affect the type of plant? Uh, yes, 100 percently it affects the plant as uh, we can see it as in desert areas there are no types of trees or other kinds of plants and only cactus can be seen in th that type of uh, soil but uh, if I talk about the soil in our fields mm -hmm. uh, that are quite watery and uh, so, uh, full of minerals so the plant gets too much nutrition. Okay, let's, let's move on to uh, the point that is the dreams. Do you often have a dreams when you sleep? Uh, yes, uh, I often uh, went in the dreams when I sleep and I uh, recently also have dream in last night. Do you usually remember your dreams? Uh, no, I don't remember much dreams but uh, with the dreams which are quite horrible or which are quite uh, 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 quite interesting, I remember them only. Do you think dreams are important to remember? Uh, no, I don't think because it's the meaningless and dreams are the only thing, uh, only based on the, the visual we see in our, our whole day and that comes to bind up in our uh, interesting uh, mind mm -hmm. and then we saw the dreams. Do you ever have a daydream? Uh, yes, I remember. I when Sometimes when I feel uh, uh, lazy in the day, I take a nap. I usually get a dream in the daytime also. What kinds of daydreams do you usually have? Uh, as I remember, I don't, uh, I don't uh, re uh, remember my dreams uh, mm -hmm. properly, but uh, I can say that uh, very fluctuating dreams. Like uh, sometime I am, uh, uh, I am going in the uh, traveling in some uh, abroad cities, or I am waving in the air, and this kind of dreams. Okay, only. now I'm going to give you a topic, and you're having a minute to prepare your answer. Here is a pencil and paper for you, and here is. Your topic, describe a place you like to visit but you don't want to live there. Yes, please. Uh, uh, well, I like many places uh, which I have I want to visit, but I don't like to live there. And one of the places I I'm I am going to describe now is Amritsar, as it's a holy place in my country and is quite popular for uh, golden temple, as it is the symbol of uh, 
Sikh, tem uh, Sikh temples, uh, which is quite popular in my country also. Uh, many people visit from different uh, areas and uh, different countries. <coughs> and I also visit uh, usually uh, two times a year as for getting the blessings of, uh, uh, of God. And uh, <coughs> I want to uh, went there because of the popularity of that place and so see the different traditions of peoples from different parts of my country and also the other countries as people come there with their uh, traditional dresses and traditional foods and I like the thing that the most but I don't want to live there because of the some facilities like there are there there is much crowd uh, and I don't like the crowded places and also one main problem is that hospital facilities are very less and I remember where it's uh, last year when I went with my grandmother and my grandmother got accidentally injured on that time and we take them to the hospital took them to the hospital on that time and but we see but we see that there there was very much crowd and our turn comes around after uh, two to three hours and uh, which was uh, quite painful for my which, which was quite painful for my grandmother and I also feel very sad that uh, this kind of uh, problems can occur in these uh, developed uh, developed states and but yes uh, I, so that's why that's the reason that I want don't want to live there but uh, I visit that place as to get the blessings of the God uh, or to some or so or to purchase some things or uh, seeing mm -hmm. a tourist also okay thank you what kind of a places are very much popular in your country uh, well in my country many kinds of places are popular like as i already mentioned golden temple mm -hmm. and other places like uh, chandigarh uh, which is quite popular for its uh, zoo and uh, rose garden rock garden and people usually visit that place mm -hmm. and other places like uh, historical monuments in my country that like taj mahal qutub minar red fort okay. india gate etc what type of uh, apartments or homes do most people in your country like to live uh, well in the village areas people usually prefer to live their own house which is built on uh, their own land but if i talk about the uh, developed developed cities the people mostly prefer to live in the apartments or apartments which uh, which are quite uh, comfortable for them as they provide various kinds of facilities with the, the apartment as in the in the villages the people have to build everything by their own but in the apartments uh, everything is provided by the owners so do okay. people in your country like to invite others as a guests uh, yes it's uh, it's uh, uh, very uh, very important for my, for my people of my country that they invite guests and they uh, welcome them uh, the most because as uh, as in my country it is said that a guest are uh, guest are belong to the gods and never uh, never disrespect dis disrespect the guest as uh, they are be, uh, they are like the gods so we in my country people treat the guest very well do people give gifts when they visit each other uh, yes so, uh, usually people give gifts on the occasions or like birthday parties or some other occasions which uh, another family family is going to held or uh, on the, in that cases people usually prefer to give gifts uh, for example uh, we take gift to the relatives whenever uh, there is some, uh, some uh, occasions like anniversary or birthday of my cousins what is the difference between the houses in the city centers and in the suburbs uh, well villages are quite uh, uh, pollution free and if i talk about uh, uh, city sites they are quite uh, crowded and uh, uh, full of pollution because of the vehicles are uh, provide too much crowds and I think suburbs are the best in my opinion to, for living but countryside is quite uh, fuzzy for uh, everyone. Okay, thank you. That's the end of your speaking test. Okay, sir.